What I hear about my grandfather was that um, he was, like my dad, very people-oriented and he was one to bring home people that he met here who maybe had hit hard times or just needed some dinner or whatever and so my grandparents lived in Brighton and he was known for just bringing strangers home to dinner and taking care of them and then sending them on their way. I've had a lot of people tell me that about him so uh, he was a pretty endearing guy. They both were really special people. So the Swan Boat started in 1877. My great-grandfather Robert in 1870 so he was granted permission from the city council at that point to have a small fleet of rowboats in here that he could rent out as a business and seven years later he launched the first swan boat. The aesthetic influence comes from an opera that was a Wagner opera called Lohengrin, and apparently my great-grandparents were opera fans, and they had actually traveled to New York to see this opera, which is a big deal. And in the story, there's a soldier who has to rescue a princess, and the way he does that is he has to cross a body of water, he's, on a, he's standing up on a boat, and he's drawn by a swan, and they actually call it a swan boat in German, in the opera. So that, that was, I guess, the the inspiration for the swan. I think that in order to keep this going through the generations, the, the philosophy has always been that this should be an amenity for the city, it should be an affordable activity, and should be safe and really enjoyable. And, uh, and I think those principles have really helped keep it what it is.